and we'll kick you with another Jagaria Lash video. We got a lot to talk about, so it, there was a big news done today, so let's move on. They did talk about the Naughty or Naughty Superfat plot synopsis, but so, of course, there's more of that. Now, about handling inquiries over the new year, um, basically just saying, uh, yeah, the the addressing inquiries, yeah, they're not doing, yeah, essentially we won't be able to, they won't respond to feedback, they're out of the office right now, they won't be responding to feedback until January, until January 3rd at 20, at, to add essentially 8 p.m. So, anyway, moving on. Event information. Here we go. This is a big one. So, so this started off at today, at on reset. So right now, void battle triple drop events. So so far, it's for Needhog. All five dragons each day it will be switched. So today it's Needhog. Tomorrow it's Poseidon. The next day it's John D. Then then when then Wednesday is John D. Arc. Thursday is Agni, and Friday is Zephyr. Also, half stamina for advanced dragon trials and the Akito Uprising solo quest events, and that's going on to the third from today to the thirteenth of January, or uh, or, yeah. Same thing for co-op half gathering for advanced dragon trials and the Akito Uprising, advanced dragon trials and the Akito Uprising co-op double drop events. They are returning, but this time they're doing more. So so far they're just doing the the high dragons. It's only for one day, and Midgard Summer is today, tomorrow's Brunhilda, Mercury is Wednesday, th Zodiac is Thursday, Jupiter is Friday. But then, they start Volk's Wrath. After that, they start the Akito, and unlike last time where it was just Volk and Cayenne, it's all of them. Going Volk, Cayenne, Ciela, Ayaha, Notaha, and then Tartarus. So, if you have... So... Make sure you use use this to your advantage. Also, special adventure upgrade event for every element. The Fong Vents, which make it easier to upgrade adventures of every element, will be there for the duration. Drop rewards you can obtain from the elemental ruins of every element will be doubled. Same thing for Dragon Trials and the Imperial Onslaught. Avenue to Power Triple Drops and Avenue to Fortune Triple Rupees event start on January 7th. And go to the 13th. So, yeah, we get the elemental ruins, dragon tries, and put on such first from today till the 7th. And then afterwards, when the reset happens on the 7th, it's Avenue, Avenue to Power and, and Avenue to Fortune, but the triple. Also, special flame water and shadow to the adventure upgrade events. The following events, which make it easier to upgrade flame water and shadow to the adventures, will be live for the duration which is from the 7th to the 14th. So, after you do, ev after every element, it's just going to be Flame, Water, and Shadow for the Ruins and Trials and, uh, Ruins, Dragon Trials, and Imperial Onslaught. Void Battle Triple Drops. This happens after this. So, then we also get the vo the regular Void Battle tri Triple Drops for the other ones besides the well, not all of them. So, for Phantom Strike and Manticore starts on the 10th. It goes to, is from the 10th to the 11th. 11th to 12th is Truman Ghost. And 12th to 13th, it's Hermit, Go Woman, Catabarbus. I wish they would give us the double or triple drops from, or I wish they give us triple drops for the, the Chimeras. That's the only ones they haven't done, at least for the Void ones. Anyway, also, Daily Free Tenfold sum Summon Incoming, which is going to be from 1231. So, yeah, it's going to be for the new showcase that's going to happen in about... That's going to be premier the new Summon Showcase with the new event that's going to start on Thursday. 
And part one, yeah, it's a two-part banner, unfortunately. Which means that we're going to get... So, yeah. But it starts on the 31st of January. Or de of December, I mean. At 1 a.m. And it goes to the 4th for the part one. Part two is from the 7th to the 10th. So, yeah. You get four days. You get four days. You get seven days in total. 70 free summons. Between each banner. New raid event. Cursed Connections. I, yeah, this is the, first of all, the, the raid boss is Wind Attuned. It's a raid event, and it's called Cursed Connections, and it's, and yep, so, this is the new New Year's event. It starts on the 31st of December. The Prince of French prepare the great, prepare the great the new year, and the, the, Prince, the Prince of French prepare the, a tribute to greet the new year, type of there, in the Hinomoten style, or as has been the been their tradition for years. This peaceful period of reflection and celebration is shattered by the sudden appearance of a stranger named Domran, who somehow manages to wrest control of the Howardom away from our heroes. The prince joins forces with joins forces with Sami, the leader of the Oxworm clan, to take back his home from this usurper. But it soon becomes clear that the connection between Sammy and Domon is more complicated than it first appears. To get the new year off to off to a good start, the prince will have to clash with the mysterious Mukuroshu as they put their sinister sinister schemes into action. So yeah. Oh, right. Year end. There's also the year end. Gowage Gary is live right now. I'm not summoning for it because I don't need it. Which I actually want to go over him, over Gower Reborn Zephyr, because the stuff already came out for him. So, okay, whoops. Um, so, yeah, so comparing him to. Comparing him to Gallery Born Poseidon is a little bit of a tricky. So his first, so Zephyr's skill is stronger, but he is the big kicker. So total Reborn, Zeph Reborn Zeph Reborn Poseidon's combo, which is just does twenty one zero six damage. Now let's look at Zephyr, who, mind you, has. Has a three hit thing. Yeah, his his dam his combo is weaker. Uh his combo is much we is weaker, but only by a little bit. Like twenty one zero six was Poseidon's, and Zephyr's is twenty two twenty fifty five. So yeah, but still, Z Zephyr. If you don't need Zephyr, trust me. He, if you already have, he's only there to, if you don't have like, if you don't have, if you don't have value, Samakona Hanasaki. If you don't have at least three, it, it, like I was saying before, how you only need him for, and only need him if you need him for Legends Hero when it comes out. But you, can, we can wait on that, and also in. And also, there's a chance that we could get other dragons. Essentially, as of right now, the only reason why you should summon for him is if you don't have at least three. If you if, if you don't have made, Gower made Guard Summer, and you don't have at least two of either Summer Kona, either a combination a combination of two of either Summer Kona Hanasaki or Va, or Vayu, you can either have two of each of them or one of each of them on. On them, but yeah, you don't. I already have all three of those. I have Gower, I have Nagatsuma Zero, I have, yeah, yeah, that's what I meant to say, Nagatsuma Zero, but yes, yeah, so, and I already have Samukon and Sakia and Vayu, though I still need one more stone to max them bound, Gower and Anyway, moving along, uh, Daily Free Tenfold, they went over that, uh, 
Galdage Galia's live summon showcase. Yeah, the first one starts from the third thirty. 31st of December and goes to the 7th and the second one starts from the 7th and goes to the 14th there's also New Year's party packs which start on the 31st and go to the 4th uh, and the Cursed Connections Raid event goes from the 31st and ends on the 13th there's going to be a New Year's special bonus which starts on the 1st of de- January, January 1st and ends on January, and the last day is January, well, January 12th is technically the last day, though, yeah, it ends on January 13th. And here's the stuff, rupee, the first day, in total, you're getting 20 million rupees, um, 20 exquisite honeys, 20 blessed ethan ashes, one ten-fold summon voucher, 50 rainbow orbs, 400 wormite, and two champion testaments. And, of course, the upgrade event. Yeah, and to show you... Oh, yeah, and I should go to... I'm going to go to show off the Jigalia Lost. Going back to the Jigalia Lost stuff. Um, So, Nintendo Mobile, they already put something out. They put up two things. First, of course, we have... Yeah, the New Year's event and for me, some New Year's. So here's this. Th- so, yep. Yep. A New Year's special bonus event is coming. Yeah, they talk about. They already went over this, but I wanted to show off cause, because there is one other thing that we're not seeing the New Year's party pack. So here's the party packs. So the first. The first one, there's the Quad Sunlight Stone Special, which is 4,800 Diamantium and four Sunlight Stones. Eventual Upgrade Special, which is 4,800 Diamantium, 10 Champions Testament, 10 Knights Testament, 1,000 Crystals, and 1 million mana. And then the Superior Orb Special, 2,400 Diamantium, 4 Champions Testament, and 50 of each of the Tier 4 Orbs, as well as Rainbow Orbs. Those aren't the only ones, though. There's, of course, a a 1,200 Diamantium Special and a 6-star Weapon Upgrade Special. The only one that might interest me is the Quad Sunlight Stone Special, but I don't think I'm going to go for that. And the 6-star Weapon Upgrade Special. Yeah. So... And then the rest is, yeah, half gathering. Yep. Yeah, it shows you. Yeah, all of this is actually, yeah, everything there is already known. So, anyway. Yeah, we're, we're getting close to that. So there's going to be a raffle period. So, yeah. But that, all the other stuff, that's the only thing I wanted to show you, the new thing. But here's the new raid event. I said, say, oh, I'm to the West Kuzino, huh? Kuzino had the stars. Kuzino had the stars claim superiorians. Hold on. Is in grave danger. Do- oh, Doman. Ooh, this is interesting. That's Kusino, huh? Spawn of here is gone from this. So that's saying me. Hmm, where's the tenant worm at the point? Ooh, okay. Okay. By the way, the fox and mirror. Hmm. 
Mukuroshi. So there's the other one, Yoshi Tsune, Rooster One kind of still. Ooh. But if you do that, huh? Okay. Hmm. This is interesting. By the way, the fox character. No. By the way, the fox character there. Yeah, her. She's apparently the free. She's apparently going to be. The free unit. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, Kuzino him is a pen with the free unit, but yeah. And then it says Mukuroshu. I'm guessing that's the character that that they have put it out, so. Or possibly someone else, who knows. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. If you like this video, please click the like button and leave a comment down below. I shall share this video around. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell. Other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.